Will and I have met through mutual friend and I really loved your poetry and we eventually found a time to come together with Erland we just kind of sat in a room together didn't we and I think the way we started was I played something on the I think it was on a Jupiter 4 synthesizer and it had a kind of rolling deep gliding kind of sound and then um, that instantly you said I've got a poem that will go with this sound and that just kicked it all off, didn't it? It was very instinctive from that moment. In the way that Hannah described really was how the whole process panned out, either moving from a sound or a, you know, a, a piano line that would suggest a poem to me, or vice versa, I, I might say this poem somehow was in conversation with the previous poem that we'd recorded and that would suggest some music to, to, to Hannah. I think it's just really beautiful, they exist together. Um, as one piece. We found this aesthetic and these textures through the, through the recording process and I think that's testament to exactly how genuinely collaborative and in the room the, the process was. The themes that are coming out and, and are, are gelling together are, are things that we were all feeling in our generation that should be talked about and the way we're feeling kind of a lot about society at the moment and Britain and the landscape. I think of the, the record as experimental in some, some ways and hopefully something a, a bit unique and, and, and hard to pin down um, because I think that's probably a good thing in art. To describe this to anybody I would say it's titled Chalk Hill Blue. It's something electric with words and music, pastoral, look at landscape. It's definitely something rare and special, much like the butterfly itself. I think as we start to explore the live element, there's a definite exploration of the themes further and how we can perform them together.